we're rolling. Right, welcome back to another small fire production adventure. For this, uh, for this little episode, we're on the River Burr, which is part of the, uh, the Norfolk Broads River systems. We're, uh, I'm here for usual, as my little partner in crime, Dave. He's, uh, he's in the van sorting some stuff out. And uh, we've got three days here, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And uh, to be honest, the weather ain't looking too great. They've pretty much predicted rain throughout the whole three days. So we've got umbrellas, all the waterproofs, and uh, really, you just got to try and tough it out. You know, you might get wet, but we're here fish. We're going to go have a good crack at it. Uh, we're going to do things a little bit different than normally. As you can see, we brought a little big 245 along with us. Dave's going to float about that on the weekend on his own, and uh, I've gone and eyed myself a little 12 foot sea strike. Uh, got it from company Richardson's, just round the corner, 120 quid for three days, so uh, ain't too bad really. Because there's, uh, there's so much water to go at, we're going to sort of travel down the river together, when we find a new little spot, we're going to split up like 50 yards between us, and then just sit there, hopefully try and land on a few fish. We're, uh, we're here for the pike mainly, so uh, we're going to pretty much keep it the same as what we normally do. I'm going to fish, to be honest, lures most of the weekend, try and snare them on the lures, because uh, that's my preferred uh, tackers really. But uh, if that don't happen and you ain't really getting too many fish, I've, uh, I've got all my bait rods, my live bait rods and everything else, so I can uh, always chuck a little live out if you get a little follow. Always pick up a little bonus fish, you know. Um, yeah, we've also done a bit of research online through Facebook and that. Spoke to a few local tackle shops and uh, there's been a few half decent perch coming out, so I've got my little drop shot and rod and I think over night time, just before it gets dark, sort of dusk hour, I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna have a go near a few structures, a little bit of drop shine, a little uh, mini jig heads and all that really. So uh, yeah, that's what we're gonna do really. I'm, uh, I'm gonna speak to Dave quick, wish him good luck. He's just gonna get uh, the license for his boat so he can get on the water. And that's it, gonna get the rods out, get on the water, hopefully have a good few results and uh, we'll make a nice little video. Peace. We're literally just about to take the picture of my one, the first one we've caught all day. Yeah. And as the saying goes, just like a London bus, two come at the same time. Right. Literally just about to take a photo and the float screamed off, we're just cruising along. Oh, we're starting to wonder what was going on. We had a little switch of spots and now we just did two fish. We've had monsoons. It's been it's tough It's absolutely going. belted down for about the only last the three hours. Survives. Have a little look. In. I know they're only jacks, but you don't know how peaking we're feeling right now. Small little pike, and but he's only just took that one. And all oh, look at that treble in his movie. See that straight in his scissors. Yes, Evans, we've finally got a fish on the yeah, boat, guys. Fish, at least we know where we're aiming now. You know what I mean? It's the broads is a big old place when you don't hit a few fish, it's a bit, it's a bit deflating. But we've just had two in two chucks, so maybe we've hit a couple of fish, maybe it's a stroke of luck, but it's something to go off. If he picks his spirits up anyway, doesn't it? Right. I guess you're going again. Oosh <laughs> guy! Right. But you never know. Fish. They're only small, but they're more than welcome on this boat. Boosts the morale, gets everyone going again, so. Let's get him back. Let's get another one.
Yes, capture out on the wild broad with a with a lion through roach, savage gear roach, yeah? Took it on the bounce. Best fish Shallow of the day. Shallow water and all, probably like what, five foot grassy weed about and all. It's tough fishing out here today, but I'm happy with that fish. Happy day. <laughs> And a tough, yeah, yeah. a tough day on the broads continues. Uh, it's been 50-50 on the methods. We've had them on, on the trawling lives, and we've had them on on the uh, on the lures. Um, I had a big perch follow me in on a little bait earlier, uh, around near where we're staying. But it's it's been a tough day. Uh, it's been a tough day. It's been pissing down after day. Really, uh, we just wet suited it up and cracked on with it. We ain't been whinging. We've been grafting really. But we've had what? What we had now? Uh, four, no, two apiece. Four, four fish, two a piece between us. It's been a tough, tough day. But um, that's the bros for you, mate. It's what that's the bros for you. It is tough. The big tough. girls are here, but you've got to graft for them, and that's what we're about. That's why we're fully wet suited out, we're out in the rain, like a pair of nutcases. Um, and that's it, grafting to the death, really. SFP style, isn't it? Now, what do you say about that? What we do, baby. <laughs> Even though everyone else is seen indoors in the nice, warm, cozy houses. We're in the middle of the brawl, still pissing down the rain, looking like a pair of chumps, but we're out here still giving it a go. It's what we do, it's what we do, it's yeah, so uh, it, hopefully we're going to get a couple more in it. We're putting the work in, like, we're not what fuck it, we're, we're grafting for it, but uh, it's what it's all about, innit? You've got to be in it to win it. So hopefully next time I turn this camera on, we're going to have a little pike on a bank. Right, this, this, weren't, this weren't really supposed to happen. Mr. Fanta Fishing's turned up and fucking nailed a decent perch, look. Look at this guy, look at this happiness, look. <laughs> Second chuck. Second chuck. Just down in the margins to see him shoot out. Wallop. Nailed it on a the little shad there, a little spiky shad. Happy Buzzing. guy, happy guy. Buzzing. Good start to the day. Good start to the day, it's better than the weather, but we're out here, we've travelled up river, yeah? We've come up from where we was yesterday, we only had them four jacks. And now uh, we've come up to see if we can uh, just try some more water, a different area in it, but uh, I've got a dead bait out, I'm just getting the rods and all the rods and the boat sorted, the mate he's only gone and hooked his PB perch isn't he, we're just going to get it on the pans now and see, see what it weighs, macho, boom. quick update of how things have been going just why I ain't belting down with rain for five minutes so uh, basically it's the second day we've come out we've had a few pike already we've had um, a foller Matt had a decent perch of uh, one pound nine I think it was we've had a couple of jacks a uh, couple of follers um, that little jack I just had was just just down there just in the margin there but um, the weather has been grotty but uh, only the fit to survive and all that so uh, we're just cracking on cracking at it the beers are going to come out in a minute, so uh, hopefully there'll be a couple more fish to show you, yeah? Yeah, the uh, the lures I've been having them on, I've, I've, had, I've had most of my fish today on this one, the old Fox Xander Pro Shad there in the uh, perch pattern with a 15 gram jigged. Um, Matt said he's on, on green lures, I think. Green seems to be working pretty well. But um, I'm just going to keep on with this one, persist with this one whilst the tail's still hanging on because it's half shredded off but I'm just going to crack on with this one and maybe have a little switch up later try and nick another fish quick but uh, yeah that's how it's going down at the minute the bait rods ain't really up to much to be fair Matt had a bite on a bait rod uh, it didn't have the hooks like it just shredded the bait but um, they ain't really been up to much to be fair but I'm just leapfrogging down a river I have been floating but I'm just plotted up under this tree for a minute but I'm just pipping along slowly just putting it in all the little nooks and crannies really but it's tough going out here, it's tough going, but we're cracking on, we're cracking on.
this boy. It's nice, man. Ten pounds six ounces on a green shed, Fox Rage shed. Happy one. Took that right by the boat. That. That's fully just made me happy. That. So all we've been having is jacks until now. It's a good fish. So my long. Best, my best broad fish for a while. That one. Happy days. Get uh, back sausage. Yes. Yeah. Thank God we got a bit of fish. Devons! No. What? Oh, don't tell me that weren't recording. Oh, it's changed. Oh no, it ain't. Seven minutes. It's all about the small fry, bro. All these, all these, all these imitators. <laughs> yes. 